This commenter thinks I'm gay for participating in a school play and hosting a fashion show. So I guess in your mind, literally every actor ever is gay, including The Rock. Hugh Jackman? Also gay. Robert Downey Jr.? Also gay. Chris Evans? Chris Hemsworth? All gay. John Cena? Gay. Henry Cavill? Gay. Pedro Pascal? Gay daddy. If you're not comfortable enough with your own sexuality to express yourself in ways that aren't the hypermasculine view that you think that men have to be, then I think that you are the one who might not be fully straight. I'm very confident in my sexuality. I know that I'm straight. And within that, I allow myself to participate and engage in activities that I think are fun or funny or allow other people to smile and have a good time. And I can do all of that without being insecure in myself. And I think that's what real masculinity is. Masculinity comes in many shapes and sizes. And there are many hyper-masculine people with some feminine traits that allow them to actually exemplify their masculinity in a more secure way. Think the big, strong, nurturing type that's also emotionally available. I'll tag a creator down below as an example. Also, I hosted a fashion show. It was me and then all the girls in my school. Even for the drama plays, it was me, a handful of guys, and all the girls, the dancers, etc. If you think that's gay, I don't know what to tell you. Because if anything, being on the football team is kind of gay. Just surrounded by a bunch of dudes in a locker room. And just so we're all clear, that was obviously sarcasm. There are no gay sports. On second thought, I am sure there's going to be at least one queer person in my comments telling me of a sport that is inherently gay, but I don't know what it is. Long story short, grow up, bud.